the oldest known bird in the world, 74-year-old female albatross, he expects another offspring. A female albatross named Wisdom has filed at Midway at all another egg. It wouldn't be surprising if it wasn't for the age of the bird, and this one scientist's estimate for 74 years. Ornithologists studying birds on Atoll indicate that Wisdom laid 50 to 60 eggs during her lifetime. Group of Dark Liban Albatross, Phoebastria Immutabilis, which the Wisdom belongs to, he returns to the Atoll Midway every year, near Hawaii, to put the balls down. Wisdom was ringed by biologists after laying an egg on Atoll in 1956. Because albatross don't lay eggs before they finish the age of 5, researchers are now estimating her age at least 74. Scientists from the US Fish and Wildlife Service believe that Wisdom could lay 50 to 60 eggs in her lifetime, of which even 30 became fully developed with chicks. Most of them have come from her a long-time partner, Ake Akamai with whom he had been in a relationship for about 60 years. The worms of dark lysis are mostly monogamous animals and are known for that they pair up for life. Akeakamaya was last seen on the atoll in 2020. In the he didn't show up to Midway. Scientists have acknowledged that most likely he's dead. Although albatross are paired for life, if necessary, they can find new partners. So it happened in this too the case. Wisdom has recently begun to recommend itself to other males. After seeing her with her new partner, they were also noticed, that 74 year old Wisdom laid an egg and a new partner helps them get out. Most eggs are laid on the atoll in early December. The female lays one egg every year. The incubation period of albatross eggs is 64 to 65 the days. Most chicks hatch in January or February of the following year. It is up to you it may be a tense wait, but scientists believe that despite their age, wisdom should be looking forward to another descendant. Approximately 70 to 80 percent of the eggs that are there are hatching each year folding here. Then about 50% of them will actually survive, leave the nest in Midway explained biologist John Plissner of Midway at All National Wildlife Refuge. The wisdom is unique. There are no other birds here, which would even be close to her age. The nearest one we know, they have about 45 years, he added. The average life expectancy of birds varies greatly depending on the from the species. Small birds often live only two to three years, while seabirds, including albatross and penguins, sometimes live to be 50 to 60 years old. Cryoelectron microscopy betrays mechanisms survive the bacteria. Scientists have observed in images an unprecedented resolution of the mechanism of action of DNA gyrosy, a key enzyme for survive the bacteria. This discovery opens the way for antibiotics effective against treatment-resistant infections assess biotechnologists from UJ who have studied the enzyme using advanced microscopy the cryoelectric. According to the Malopolska Center for Biotechnology Jogelonian University, Polish researchers in cooperation with scientists from the University of Durham and John Innes Center have made a breakthrough in DNA gyrase research a key bacterial enzyme and an important goal therapeutic for antibiotics. Gyrosa DNA occurs only in bacteria and plays a necessary role in the process of supertwisting DNA, which is crucial for survive the bacteria. Researchers used advanced microscopy methods cryoelectronic and captured details of the mechanism of action of this enzyme on a level that is emphasized in the press release has not been before it's possible. As the researchers explain in the message, DNA gyrus acts as a microscopic molecular machine, twisting and stabilizing the DNA of bacteria. This process, known as supertwisting, 
like twisting an eraser the more it is twisted, the more compact structure it becomes. In the however, unlike the eraser, which after release quickly unleash, gyrosis stabilizes twisted DNA, allowing bacteria to use it into the biological processes. This enzyme arranges the DNA into a loop resembling an 8, then he cuts precisely, twists and reconnects the DNA helix. This is a, an extremely delicate process if the DNA remained damaged, it would be for the deadly bacteria. Antibiotics, such as fluoroquinolones, prevent re fusion of slit DNA, which leads to bacterial cell death. However, the increasing resistance of bacteria to these drugs prompted scientists to take trying to understand a deeper understanding of the mechanism of gyrosy. In the publication, which appeared in the journal Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences scientists have shown how this enzyme wraps DNA around stretched protein arms, giving it the characteristic shape of the 8. Accurate protein structure with the DNA fragment transported this is a huge step forward towards the full characteristics of the mechanism catalytic gyrosy says Elizabeth Michalczyk, PhD student from Malopolska Center for Biotechnology and first author of the work. Images obtained in the study show the enzyme as a coordinated, multi-element system in which each part it moves in a precise sequence and enables the process of superscrewing DNA. CO author of the work, Professor Jonathan Heddell of the University of Durham stressed that the exact position and order of movement of complex parts the enzyme during the process of superscrewing DNA does not look as before the scientists thought. Therefore, Research results may affect the way of design new inhibitors and the development of new antibiotics that will work on gyrase in a more precise way and will bypass resistance mechanisms. The team plans further research, among others, to capture additional one stages of action of the enzyme and creation of a molecular film depicting how gyrase works. This approach can help to develop the next generation antibiotics that will be more precise and effective in combating infection its bacterial. Data were collected using the Titan Electron Microscope Cryos G3I located in the National Center for Synchrotron Radiation Solaris. The research in MCB was funded by the NCN Opus 20 grant.